Hey everybody, I'm Shaz, I'm playing The Long Dark. It's the very next night after the last time we played. We've survived for 21 days, 20 hours. And it's the middle of the night, and we have all of the stuff. Oh yes, we have all the stuff we need to make a wolf skin coat. So we're going to put the lantern out. We're going to go to the workbench. And it takes 25 hours. And a hunting knife. I've also done a few things off screen. I cooked up all the meats. I boiled water with leftover fire. I have water, I have food on me. My calories are good. I'm a little tired already. So what we're going to be doing is just crafting for a while. We have food upstairs with plenty of water. And the only thing that worries me is the sewing kit. This is our only sewing kit, and it has 86% of its use remaining. So hopefully it sees us through. Can we repair this? No. I meant to, but we can't. Uh, we can repair this. We don't need to. Yeah, we're going to work on making the wolf skin coat to replace our uh, mariner's pea coat. So... Where's that? 25 hours. Oh yeah, I took the time and repaired my tools also. The knife and the hatchet are in good condition. So the first stint is going to be... We're going to go for... For 5 hours, I think. We're going to go ahead and knock it down to 20 hours. So big step. We're probably going to get tired after this, I would say. We're damn close. And we're going to go ahead and see ourselves into the daylight hours. And we have 20 hours left. Oh, wait, it doesn't take a sewing kit. Does it? Wait, does it? No, it takes hunting knife. Right, amazing. Ha ha! <laughs> Fucking just the best news. Okay, so we're guaranteed to get this. Because the hunting knife is in great condition. Alright, we don't need a sewing That's amazing. How tired are we? We're everything. Okay, so I'm sorry, that was just the best news I've had all day. So we're going to go ahead and eat, drink, and we're going to get crafting. And we're going to probably have a little bit of editing done or whatever, but I'll try to do most of this on screen. This is the this is the big one. Look at that, plus seven warmth bonus. Holy shit, is this thing good. So we're going to do another four hours of crafting. And uh, like I said, oh, so I've had some uh, feedback and other stuff, mostly on Reddit. I made a comment about being pretty sure that Trax or the River One would probably see me out of region, and apparently they both do. So I'm definitely going to be taking the Trax out of region. Uh, uh, we're going to be doing that hopefully by day 25. We're pretty close. We're at least 22 days now, and we are now tired and hungry and thirsty again. Crafting is not easy business. It takes a toll, apparently. Standing here is just a bastard. We're we'll going to drink this water. Already getting low. I took the time and reorganized everything. We're already almost out of water again. I organized wolf pelts. Most of the guts were cured. Yeah, we're going to run upstairs and we're going to sleep some. We're going to sleep probably eight hours and get our fatigue back. We'll also stop off at the meat drawer. And, oh hell, we'll just grab up three. We're going to need them. So, oh, and a blizzard. Sleep. I'm glad we don't have to go out today. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> Never mind. No biggie. Just a little baby blizzard. And we are going to sleep for four more. And we should have just enough daylight to get us back downstairs. And then we'll sink in another another solid 12 hours or so on the coat. In the middle of the night. Got our days and nights mixed up. But that's okay. We'll get back on track very soon. So let's get downstairs. We'll get over here to the workbench in the last little bit of daylight. Get on the workbench. And... Ah, uh, wolf skin coat. Does the bear skin bedroll also takes a knife? It's good to know. 16 hours. Let's sink another four into it. Begin crafting. Oh my god, this is going to be just the biggest boon ever. We're thirsty. That's not too bad. We took 3% condition damage. I forgot to drink and eat after I woke up. I'm too excited. I want to get this coat made. This is just awesome. And we'll go ahead and eat down this wolf meat. And this wolf meat. Awesome. Get back on the workbench. Tab back over to the wolf skin coat. And we'll sink another four hours into it. Continue. Oh my god, that's all we've been doing now for the better part of fucking a day. Literally a day. Eight hours? How are we doing? We're thirsty. So we'll go ahead and drink. Top off in that department. And we should actually be able to finish this. We're going to be wore out by the time it's over. So we're going to sink four more hours again. Begin crafting. Oh my god, we did it. I think we're going to be doing it. It's going to be the best. 
Oh, uh, we're gonna be so fucking warm after this. It's gonna be crazy. How are we doing? Oh, we're just fine. We're gonna finish it out. We're gonna tab over to the coat. And we're gonna finish it out. Begin crafting. Oh my god, I'm too excited. Oh, we're over encumbered. And we're thirsty. And we're tired. That's okay. We're a lot of things, but we have it. Crafted wolf skin coat. Holy shit. We are going to be so warm. Let's go ahead and eat up. We're probably... Huh? Yeah. Burn through the calories doing that. Alright. 16 and 10. 16 clothing, 10 wind chill. Let's equip this beast. How good is the pea coat? 3 and 1.5. Aw, oh, wolf skin coat. Handcrafted outer layer. Warm, tough, and tells wolves and everyone else you were not to be trifled with. Wear that shit. Hell yeah. Plus 19 and plus 14. It is just so warm. We have such good wind chill now. And we are fucking exhausted after that. We're dressed in full crafted gear now, I believe. We have deerskin boots. We have deerskin pants. We have a wolf skin coat. Oh, that's wool socks. And we have rabbit skin mitts. That's just amazing. Do we have a cured deer pelt? Pretty close. We're pretty. Is there one in the drawer? <laughs> no. Is there one over here? No. Okay. So we're pretty close, and we'll repair our boots with that. So let's get upstairs. I think I still have the nasty water on us. I don't have any firewood, though. Eight hours of daylight. And there's going to be a bunch of darkness. Uh, I think I'm going to go downstairs and grab up a little bit of firewood. Nothing too crazy. I'll grab up I'll grab up a fur. That should be enough. An hour and a half. Ah, oh, I need cattail heads while I'm thinking about it. So we'll get in the bottom drawer. There's tinder plugs. Oh, nope. And we'll grab up three cattail heads. And we're going to get back upstairs. And we're going to sleep first. We're just going to sleep until close to dark. Then we're going to just boil up some water. And then we're going to continue to sleep until morning. We're on 23 day 6 hours. And I want to leave region in the next day and a half. So I have about a day to deal with stuff. And I think the agenda will be hunting wolves, hunting rabbits, hunting deer, and getting as much surplus meat as we can real quick. How, clo how good are we doing with meat? We're, we're out. We're out of meat. So I think that'll be the thing. We're going to need meat to do our traveling. And then we should be good. We'll use our last day to get ready, and then well, tomorrow we're going to try to leave region. So, let's get some sleep. I will see you guys bright and early in the morning. I know there's eight hours of daylight left, but I do mean tomorrow morning. Good night. Alright, it is morning now, and we have 24 days, three hours survived, which means tomorrow, in exactly about 24 hours, we're going to be trying to leave region. We're going to pack up, and we're going to go establish a new home base in another region, and we're going to fight Mother Nature elsewhere. I've took a bunch of stuff with me. I've went ahead and packed up about what I think I'm going to be taking, minus the food. So that'll probably max us out. We're not going to be picking up and carrying and taking a lot of shit we might find on the way. Instead, we'll backtrack and get all of that and bring it to the new base and set it up. I took six antibiotics, my only bottle of antiseptic, three bandages, two ibuprofen, and a rose hip tea. So we have two sprains we can get through. Got our gear. We've stashed everything we're not wearing. I'm carrying a lot of extra water. A lot of that will get drunk down, and I'll take the remaining water from our stash. I have my normal tools. We're baking both weapons. We have the hunting rifle with nine rounds loaded and a nearly broken bow. I've also took our simple arrow. Uh, what else? I have matches restocked. I've got some flares. I've got the sewing kit. I've got both of our tools. Knife is a little bit beat up now, but it's about what it used to be. I've took four cedar firewood, all of our extra harvestable stuff because it's lightweight and we might find more. And I took a birch sapling. If our arrow breaks... Ah, crow feathers. Let's get up off the Lazy Boy. Possibly the last time we'll sit in it. We'll get in our drawer. And we're going to grab up a handful of crow feathers. Yeah, four should be fine. They're lightweight and needed to craft arrows. So we have all the things to craft arrows at a workbench if we find one. And today, we're going to make our way on screen over to the rabbits. We might try to do some hunting today. Maybe nature will leave a deer corpse in front of our door. And I think... Aw, oh, it looks nice out here. How does it feel? It feels like 2. It's negative 18 out with a negative 7 wind chill, and it feels like 2 degrees. Fuck yes, we are on the top of the world. I've heard a few other things through Reddit I mentioned earlier, so I know that other regions are going to be drastically colder, have harsher conditions, etc. This is probably the easiest of them. 
Ah, prey. Our first victim. So there's our meat for the trip. Is this unlucky wolf. We're going to sneak in and we're going to go for a headshot. Hopefully a clean kill. We're going to take the meat. Probably take the pelt and leave it behind to cure. Might take the guts also. We might just clean this guy out. Go move, clean the rabbits out. And then come back home. This is the first order of business today. We're going to kill this wolf. And we're going to stock up some meat for the trip. We might not cook it. I'm not sure. We'll probably cook, we probably cook it. We'll cook it tonight. We'll cook up everything tonight. We want to be completely prepared tomorrow. And hopefully tomorrow morning there's no blizzards or other bullshit that we have to deal with. Hopefully we can actually get out. We're going to hit the railroad tracks. And we're just going to follow them. And hopefully it leads us right out of region. I'm not sure what region it goes to. I know all the names of the regions. Just from the uh, like sandbox creation thing or whatever. But I have no idea how they're connected. I think it tells you now, though. I think you can actually go and look. I just haven't. <laughs> this wolf is moving significantly faster than me. Oh, there we go. I kind of mildly got his attention. Somebody else suggested that I be using decoys to hunt. And decoys are very effective and good. And I probably will start doing that very soon. Alright. Game time. Me versus wolf. Man versus nature. He sticks out like a sore thumb on this lake. Jet black. Wolves are notoriously evil. He communes with the devil. Maybe. Who am I to judge? Alright, here we go. Ah, hit him. Didn't kill him. Hit him. Damn, thought I heard another wolf. That kind of freaked me out. Well, he took our arrow with him, so we have to find him. I do not want to lose my one arrow. Oh my god, he just, like, took the fuck off into the mountains. Of, of course. Of course. Why wouldn't he? Why wouldn't he? He just took our arrow out into the fucking woods. Oh well. We're going to follow him, and then we'll hit the... There's another wolf. We might go for twin kills today and just stock up on wolf meat and forego our rabbits. Maybe. So far so good. At least we can get up here. He probably just went across this and went onto the uh, lake. Maybe. It's hard to, he could have went anywhere, truthfully. We have to find him, though. He has our arrow. Yep, there he is. He's on the lake, just running. And we may end up bagging a second wolf off the back of this. Also, it's worth doing to stop in and gather some cloth if we needed it. We could gather up some cloth from inside of these buildings by breaking down any armchairs or any anything like that. He's got a lot of energy. I hit him in, I think, the shoulder no, now. Alright, I'm going to continue to stalk this guy for a moment. I'm going to clean him out of meat and pelt and probably guts and then if that other wolf is still lingering we're probably gonna go for round two mastering the hunt yeah I will see you in a moment oh my god I'm still tailing this wolf and I see another wolf if shit comes to shit we have the rifle but I don't know if I really want to use that also a fucking ton of Pringles just look at this Pringles everywhere at least we're gonna be around this little hill we might be okay. We're still going to harvest this guy first. Also, with our new coat, apparently wolves can be intimidated by us and run away. Because, I mean, we're wearing their friends. So yeah, let's harvest these Pringles. Free cattail heads, a little bit of food. Living off the land. Grab up this. There's at least a couple more. And then we're going to harvest this wolf. By the way, I have entered into a shitstorm. It still feels like four degrees. That's amazing. I'm loving this new clo or new clothing. It's just just too good. Alright, we gathered up the Pringles on this side. There's still some more though, which is pretty nice. We'll probably get them as well if we have time. How's the arrow doing? 73%? Pretty good. Alright, we're going to take four kilograms of meat. Uh we'll get the meat first. Yeah, we'll harvest the meat. Not a blizzard yet. It's definitely winding like crazy. Uh, we'll grab the gut. Yeah, we'll grab the rest of this. It'll take 50 minutes. 
we should be okay. We shouldn't even really get too cold at all, if any. Have we? No, we're perfectly fine. And we have meat and other stuff now. We're also over encumbered, which I kind of anticipated. We're going to eat up some cattails fast. Just a couple. We'll go back over a thousand calories. And we'll drink down some water. And this should put us under weight from drinking the water. Should. Yeah, it definitely will. I lied. I completely lied out my ass. Okay, fair enough. How does it feel? It feels like six degrees. Can you believe it? I mean, it is legitimately warm as shit out here. This is very nice. Wolves, I didn't know it felt so good to be a wolf. Oh, yeah, cattails. Uh, we're gonna get these. Takes a second. Amazing, amazing thing. That branch looks kind of weird. Uh, three more? Two more wolves? Jeez. Wolves own the lake today. They just own it. I mean, they're everywhere. There's three out here. Gather up some cattails. There's some more on this other side. Uh, uh, do we hunt another wolf? Do we just forego the rabbits and just kill a bunch of freaking wolves? In this condition, I worry about my accuracy. Also two of them. That's just worrisome. Ah, oh, decisions. Uh, I have decoy. I wonder, is that cannibal? Man, that's like weird wolf cannibalism. I'm going to try to decoy these guys with their friends, <laughs> if I have to. Until then, we can get over here and probably get some cattails and let this wolf wander close. And we're going to get the bow ready. He's wandering right into us. Alright, well, never mind. We'll get the cattails. Oh, are they both wandering? They're both wandering into me. No! <laughs> Go away, wolves! No. No, wolves. No, wolves. Don't do it. No, why are you so evil? Spawn of Satan. No. Oh. Of, co of course. Of course. Oh, uh, where's my meat? Okay, he was not interested in the meat. And we didn't actually get a sprain today. Amazing. I hit him. I did I hit him? I don't know. Maybe. Yes. I hit him. Where's my arrow? Fuck. Panic. Too much action. And I think if either that wolf has my arrow or I might have uh, skimmed it across the ice. Not entirely sure. Uh. Arrow. Oh, shit. That's surely a different wolf yet, isn't it? How have I lost my arrow out here? I hope that wolf didn't take it. I really hope that wolf didn't take it. I'm just looking all around the ground and don't see it. Oh, hey. Oh, I see it! And I see a wolf running. But I see my arrow. Thank God. Alright, let's get the arrow first. So that other wolf over here is probably not even damaged yet. Jesus. And there's another wolf that's knifed and hurt. Would be a mate. How are we doing? Two degrees? We're fine. Holy shit. Let's go over here and get the cattails. If the wolf attacks us, we'll take him down too. Shit. Too many wolves. They were not impressed by my coat. It's got to be said. They were just not impressed in the least. I see that wolf just in front of me. Not caring at all about my coat. Alright. Uh, let's go get this wolf then. We're gonna just grab his meat. I think we're just gonna forego the rabbits today. We're just gonna live off wolf meat. With its 700 calories of amazingness. Alright, let's go and get up. Should have... Nope, I don't think we do. Let's see if we can, uh, decoy him. Oh my god, we might really have hit the jackpot today. So we're gonna have a wolf over there. We're gonna have a wolf on the decoy. Let's get our bow out. Oh my god, pincer movement. How many wolves have attacked me today? Or are killed or anything, whatever. I mean, I've hit the two and they ran away. I've been attacked by the one that I knifed, and now there's this guy. There's a wolf right there that's wounded, and he's eating. So we're going to sneak in here and just see if we can't grab yet another kill. Wolf, wolf city, baby. Wolf, wolf city! 
Alright, no, I hit him. Did I hit him? Did I hit him? I think I hit him. I think he might have my arrow also. <laughs> I cannot seem to keep track of it. Uh, did I hit him? Or did I scare him? I think I scared him. And I just still don't see my arrow again. Fuck me. There it is. Okay, I see the arrow. And I definitely just scared the wolf. I don't know how I keep losing that air. <laughs> Alright, let's grab some cattails. Super quick, because we're standing right here. Okay, we definitely missed the wolf. Not a good shot, but that's okay. We have the other wolf. We scared that one off of us. Lost a kilo of wolf meat in the process, because he was hungry. Keeping an eye out. Might flank us. They're Trixie. Trixie wolves. I think it's good for now. Alright, let's get over here to our prize. And maybe we'll, maybe we'll run across the other corpse. I mean, that would be pretty freaking amazing. Get fucking three wolves to to strip down today. I see more uh, Pringles. Uh, he's just wandering. He's cool. He's chill. It's been a dangerous day. All right, grab up the Pringles. There's only a few of them. Shouldn't take but a second. Free calories, anyways. And a tender. Alright, how's the wolf back there just wandering around? I don't see the third wolf corpse anywhere. He's probably took off into the mountains. But, we're gonna go ahead and uh, cash out on another wolf. We'll take the three, and the hide, and the guts. We're gonna take all of it. Take an hour 14. Alright, and we still have a bunch of daylight left, but we are very hungry. So we're going to eat up some Pringles. Goddamn Pringles. Mother Nature, you are the best. Sometimes. Alright, we'll eat down until... Or until we get to a thousand calories. That'll do. Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. Where... There's another wolf. We could go for another wolf. It's getting a little bit dark. There's six hours of daylight, but it is awfully dark. There is clearly a shitstorm coming. Do we want to go for this last wolf? He could end up taking us... Uh, not this one. We could go hit the rabbits. We know our way back from the rabbits. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to go set off and go to the rabbits. It's been a productive day, though. We've gotten a lot of food. And we'll be able to uh, transition and take that with us. A lot of that will definitely be coming. We're going to have a big cooking session tonight. We're going to fill up big and we're going to take some food with us. If we find new places, we're probably not going to take very much. At best, we'll take lightweight stuff, make a note of it, and come back later, and then bring it to the new uh, base camp. And ideally, I would like... Have we been in here? Yeah, just making sure. Uh, just making sure. Ideally, we want to... Um, hell, I don't know. Ideally, we want to have a base camp in every single region, just because that would be nice. We could just go around periodically. It'll keep us moving a lot. It'll keep it interesting. Uh... And we'll just have different places we can fall back on if one of them becomes empty or anything goes awry. I think that's the best way to approach it, for just fun factor and just the sake of recording. So that's what I'm trying to do. And I think at 25 days, that's that seems to me to be kind of early. Like, I'm trying to make big moves. I've already got my crafted gear in line now. I've got a means to defend myself. I've got steady food. So far, so good. Things are looking up. It's warm. It feels like 8 degrees. I'm outside and it feels like 8 degrees. I mean, that is fabulous to me. Anybody else? Like, that's pretty pretty awesome feeling. We've been outside and just winds and snow and getting attacked and just nothing's wrong. Actually, we had our clothing damaged and I'm curious if it was the coat. Well, it's kind of the coat. Also, the mittens and the boots and just everything. Everything is just getting beat the hell up. Mainly because we keep fighting wolves non-stop. And we may be fighting some more wolves. I mean, shit, the day is still kind of young. We could have followed the river, but I think the tracks, I just, I don't know, fuck it. We've done so much on the tracks in this playthrough. Let's continue on. Let's let the tracks see us out of this place. And in saying this, I'm not entirely sure where the way out is. We're going to find it. That's why we're taking supplies and hopes and prayers and all that crap. I just know the tracks will lead you in the right direction. Uh, fur limb. We could do some firewood. 
We might on the way back. I said that before, I know, on the exact same fur limb. And we may. It'll be indoor fire. We're not taking it with us. It weighs too damn much. Could just hunt a rabbit, but I think we're just going to go check the traps. The traps should have corpses in them, and we'll get a little bit of extra meat. Maybe get their fur, maybe guts. I think it's like 40-some minutes per rabbit. That's not too, too bad. We're already over-encumbered. We're going to have to definitely drop off the guts and pelts before we leave. But yeah, tomorrow's the day, guys. Tomorrow is the day. We're setting out on a big adventure. The whole world, well, the whole Canada is ahead of us. Canada's a big damn place. A really big damn place. I mean, it's just, it's a huge country. It's mostly this, though. I'm pretty sure the northern parts. It's a lot of snow. It's definitely got the northern hemisphere covered. Is anybody be keeping up with, like, fucking social medias of, like, celebrities and crap? Like, so many people lately have thought the world is flat. Oh my god, wolf. No, wrong weapon. He's definitely gonna get the drop. Maybe. Yep, there he is. No. I hit him. And there goes my arrow. Yet again. Also dropped a wolf meat. Shit. I want that. <laughs> Give me my wolf meat. But seriously, if anybody keep keeping up with social media, there's so many, like, things going around about how the world is flat now, again. And I worry. I really worry about people. Like, that just boggles my mind. That just boggles my mind. Well, we cannot, we can't let our arrow get away. I could have used the rifle. Probably maybe should have used the rifle since I came for rabbits. But this works too. Screw it. I don't know if we're going to take this pelt. We're already weighed down and the trip back's going to take a minute. We may just go for the meat. And that alone's going to be three or four kilos. But for now, we're just following blood. Hopefully he doesn't get too far. Weather is questionable, but so far so good. I also see hanging moss, which is a uh, blood trail, which in its own way is is pretty nice. Where the hell is this guy going? He must have went around this way. Let's go and catch some, like close some distance. I know we shouldn't be sprinting, but we're going to. <laughs> I don't want to lose my arrow. If we don't even get these rabbits, that's fine. I mean, this wolf. Oh, holy shit! What is this? Where the hell am I? And is, why is there a giant suspension bridge? That's well, not giant. I don't even know if it's a suspension bridge, but it's a big fucking bridge over a frozen river. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, there he is. Oh, there's my arrow! No! No! Oh. I think he got the picture. I think he saw his friend, saw me, saw the blood, saw the limping, and was like, I don't need to fuck with that guy. I don't need to do it. Either that or it was actually the coat. He seems to have forgot, though. And this guy's just slowly... Should we explore... How I many? Four hours? We have time. We have time. We have time. Come on, wolf. I need my arrow back. And also, your friend intimidates me. <laughs> I am just surrounded out here today. It's crazy. Crazy amount of wolves. That bridge is awesome. I really want to go over there. And just see... <laughs> Uh, he's getting kind of close, which worries me. Sorry. Shit. Getting paranoid. Oh. Alright. I'm gonna watch this guy again like I did last time. I'm gonna wait for him to collapse. I'm gonna clean him out of what I need. Get my arrow back, and I will see you in just a second. Alright. The wolf is clean. I ate down a Pringle to keep myself from starving to death. And we're going to make moves. It's getting late. I think there's actually only three, yeah, three hours of daylight left. I've lost sight of this other wolf, which is okay at the moment. And I really want to... Uh, there's two hours of daylight left. And I want to see what's up over here with this bridge. I don't think we're going to try to scale and go up top, but I at least want to come over here and look around. I mean, we're here. We might not be... We may. Who knows? This might, this might be where the fucking train tracks go. I don't know if that bridge could support a train. I mean, I guess it could. Bridges are pretty pretty amazing in their own way. Alright, we can put the weapon away for a moment. We're way down. It's going to be a hefty trip back. But I think we're okay. What, wait, what is that? What is this? Is this a fire? Or... Yeah, somebody camped here. 
Under the bridge. Oh my god, is it a... Oh, it's the dam! It's the dam with the wolf in it. Fluffy! I don't think we're going to explore the dam either. We're going to come back and explore that at some point. We may stop off here tomorrow, depending on how rough the conditions are. Well, neato. It's a bridge, and I found the dam. The river... Go figure, the river leads into the dam. It, it makes perfect sense. Uh, I don't see anything else around here, though. Not right off. I mean, there could be, I guess. But I didn't I didn't see anything. It's getting late. Am I crouched? No. I'm just way down. Fuck me running. Where is he at? I don't even want to lose my arrow. I don't. I just think I'm going to decoy him. Here. Have some raw wolf meat, guy. Go on. Wolf meat. It's all for you. Oh, yeah. Uh, river? We want to follow the river? Yeah, it will school. He's just hungry. He just wants some meat. Even if it is his kin. Can I even sprint? Yeah, a little bit. I don't even know if you can call that sprinting. So, what is this? I was going to say I'll meet you back at camp. And then I notice, is this a corpse? It is a corpse. Let's see if he has anything on him. And then we're going to make our way back to camp off screen. Oh, is that a knife? Holy shit, another knife. And in damn good shape. Some condensed milk, a tinder plug. This guy had some stuff on him, damn. He even had a knife, that's crazy. Alright, that's good. That will do. Let's get back. We have more than enough stuff for the day. Wait, what is this? <laughs> I just keep seeing stuff. Oh, it's just a branch, shit. How's the weather? Four degrees. Feels amazing. We're everything... Except for cold, which I can deal with. That sounds like that sounds like a winner to me. Northern Access River. Let's see if we can find Southern Access River from here. I think we can. I think the camp thingy that we get rabbits from is right over there. Jesus, the wind. How's it feel? Still like four. Feels amazing. Feels phenomenal. Hello, wind though. Look at that. It's like a shitstorm out here. Yeah, I'll be back, guys. I will see you at home. It'll be our last night spent in Mystery Lake. Which seems okay to me. I mean, hell. We've spent weeks here, and it's been amazing. We've learned. We've tamed. We've mastered. It's time to explore more and find more. So, yeah, I will see you for our last night at Mystery Lake. Alright, we've made it. We're here and just in time for nighttime. Guy over there looking fabulous. The camp office looks amazing. Canadian flag, awesome. It's our last night here. Guy is weeping openly, sad as could be. Doesn't want us to go, but we're going anyways. So, first things first. I'm going to drop off. Oh my god, the meat we got. I'm going to drop and the cattails. Uh, where are they at? Six guts. Three wolf pelts. I did take that pelt. And... I'll take a sidestep for a second. We'll go ahead and drop off the slightly more damaged knife. Uh, whoops. There we go. Perfect. Almost. There we go. We'll put the knife there. It's almost perfect. That will bother the shit out of me, actually. I don't know why. Sorry, OCD. Look, bam. Almost. Aw, oh, nice. Good enough. And, oh, is the deer, is the deer pelt done? The deer hide is done. Let's go ahead, and we also need to recraft our arrow. It was a, it was a hectic day. So we're going to do a few things before we go to bed. We're going to chomp down, we're going to drink. Looks good. And we are going to go in here, go to our boots. I need a cured gut. I need a cured gut. No problem. I have three. We'll grab one of those. We'll go to the boots that we made, painstakingly. Almost a perfect chance of success. Repair them. Use the sewing kit. Hopefully it works. Hopefully. Yes. Awesome. It worked. So now our boots are doing better. We're up to 18 and 13. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Uh, I want to go... 68... 68. Uh, let's go ahead and eat another one last cattail head. It was delicious. 
Oh, whoops, we were on it. Where's the drawer? Workbench, drawer. There it is. We're going to get in here. We're going to grab up the guts. We're going to grab up the cured rabbit pelts. And we're also going to repair our mittens, since we're standing here. Actions, repair. And that should put them just, just under 100. If it doesn't fail. 92% didn't let me down. So, 19 and 13. We're doing really good. It's really, really, really warm. We're tired and we're very hungry. Let's go ahead and light the lantern. We'll make our way upstairs. Being tired is just slowing us down that much more. I don't mind using the lantern this time. It's our last night. We should at least be able to see what the hell we're doing. The cupboard is empty, and we're going to stash all this for now. Just for a second. Stashed. The condensed milk is downstairs. We'll place it later. Pringles are good. What else do we do? Everything's good there. Everything seems to be in order. We need to break this. Actions. Harvest. We're going to remake that arrow before we leave. Yeah, got the arrowhead, got a crow feather or two back. All three crow feathers back. And here's the old bed. We're still hungry, aren't we? We are still very hungry. So, we're just going to eat some Pringles. We're going to eat our cattail stalks today. Or at least some of them. We're going to eat down to... Four. We're going to take four with us. 482 calories. Perfect. Oh no, not five, four. Alright. We're going to rest here, and I will see you guys in the morning. In the morning, we're going to get everything sorted out for our inventory. We're going to get... Probably leave a little bit of a mess back here. We'll deal with it someday when we come back. We're going to make sure we have all the correct supplies. We're going to make sure our clothes is good enough to see us through. We're going to have cooked food by in the morning. I'll do that this evening, some point, tonight, in this night cycle. And make sure we have water. And then we're going to make the trip out, guys. We're going to make the trip out. You ready? Here we go.